Get ready, boys. It's gonna be crazy. Here it is, game over. It's a freaking big one. I feel this cast. I just had a tingling sensation down my body. Oh my God, it's a freaking giant. Oh my God, it's another giant. Yo, what's poppin' people? Welcome back to another video. Thank you guys so much for the support. Listen, man, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell. Also, hit the like button if you guys have been enjoying the content. So today, we're gonna be doing some bank fishing. You guys love the bank fishing videos, so we're bringing them back today. And uh, we're actually at a special little area. So in one of the last videos, we actually came out to this new pond on this golf course, and I caught a freaking toad. Let's roll it back. Should be one right here. See this little indention on the bank? Uh-oh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh God. It has to be six plus. <laughs> oh my gosh. That was one of the biggest fish of this year for me. So we're going to have to fish it today. Listen, man, we got to go fish it. We got to make it happen. I actually have Fletcher that's going to come out today, but he is actually taking a Schmedley right now. So I told him, I was like, bro, I'll meet you at the pond. Fish are biting. Can't be waiting on your Schmedley. We're going to get it started, guys. Let me show you exactly what we got rigged up. And then we're going to get out to that pond and hopefully just hook a mega man. I'm ready to catch another big one. Just super large, man. One of the biggest fish of the year. I'm ready for it. I got a Custom Pro on a Mach 2, and then I got a Pro TI on a Mach Crush. I got a Snatch by Six Cents right here. If you guys want to get a discount, man, I'll pop it up on the screen. You can get a discount for yourself. I can help you out. A little stroker crawl on a Texas rig. I actually think I'm going to cut off this trap, man. I'm feeling something right now. Hold on. I hate to break it to you, boys and girls, but... I think I'm getting addicted to the chatter donk again. You know, I, I just like look how good it looks. You know what I mean? It's just, <laughs> Listen, if you haven't thrown the chatter donk, it catches big fish. I've caught so many big fish last year on it, so many big fish this year on it, and I gotta try it in this juicy pond. I caught that big one last time on a little tiny Ned rig. The chatter donk has to catch a big one. So we're gonna go ahead and go over there now. I'm gonna tie this bait on though. I have a little tiny finesse trailer. This is a white and chartreuse chatter bait. That's what's been getting the most luck for me recently is the white and chartreuse. Um, throw in that little natural color. I haven't really thrown the white much, but I do have one with me just in case they don't end up eating this one. But let's go ahead and tie this on my rod, walk down to the pond, hook a big fish. Let's get it. Listen, man, we're right here next to this pond and there's a freaking good fish right there. Oh my gosh. I can't believe I, I let him swim away from me like that. That was a good one. I had to come over here and make a cast because I heard something blow up and I was like, I gotta come over here. Get ready, boys. It's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be good. We gotta check out drag. All right. Here it is, game over. It's a freaking big one, I think. I can't move him. Oh, it's a four pounder. This dude, he is fighting so hard. Oh yes, oh yes. He looks like a high three, he's not four. Mm. Mm. Look at that, choked it, choked it. I mean, Look at that, you couldn't choke it any better. <sighs> well, boys and girls, don't sleep on your boy Noah. It's exactly where I saw him blowing up and there has to be more fish. I literally landed in, in that corner where he blew up and he ate it right away. And that's a, look at that, first fish today, three pounder? What? I thought he was a four, but heck, I'll take a three any day of the week. <laughs> that's a good fish. All right, we're gonna get an awesome release on them right here. It's kind of hard to get down to the water, but we're gonna try without slipping. I got some shoes with some tread on my tires today, so. All right, pretty fish. Oh, um, look at that. First fish today, are you kidding me? Wait. <laughs> that was the best release I've ever done. Holy cow. Now that is a way to start the video. Can't, you can't make it up guys you can't make it up i literally didn't even have to reel it i like threw it in there and it was done all right we're gonna throw a couple more casts then we're gonna go to the next pond all 
All right, never throwing the chatter donk in here. Guess what? We know there's big ones in here now. Like, oh, one just swam off the bank, really small. We haven't caught many fish in here, but they're in here. And there's some freaking giants in here too, so. What do we hook another one like that, that last one? That was crazy, guys. That fish was so big. <gasps> yes! Yes, yes, yes! You were a warm one. I, I just saw something roll and then all of a sudden I just slowed it down and he said, let me just eat it real quick, Noah. Just let me have it. I said, you know what, Jimmy? I'll let you have it. And guess what? I let him have it. Look at that. Pretty little bass. You're just about a pounder, bud. You're about a pound, pound and a half. But guess what? I appreciate the bite and I hope you appreciated the meal, even though it was a fake one. See you, bud. All right. That's a good little sign. We've only casted like three or four times and we got a fish. That water is so warm. It is kind of cool out today though. I ain't gonna lie. I was like driving over here and it was a little chilly. It's a little nipply out this morning. Well, man, what a start to today's video. If it's gonna be that easy now, I don't know what to say. We just having fun, man. We having fun, enjoying life, enjoying fishing. That's what it's about, man. There's a ton of brim on the bank. That's why these bass are so big, man. They're eating these big bluegill. If I get another sales call, I swear. I feel this cast. I just have a tingling sensation down my body. Oh my God. It's a freaking giant. Oh my god, it's another giant. Oh, oh my god, this is like a... I don't even know how big he is. He's freaking giant, guys. Giant, giant, giant. I told you I had a singling, tingling, slingling, sensation. Oh my god, it's a freaking five, six pounder. Oh, oh, he's huge. Oh my god, what do I do? Oh my god. <laughs> you, you can't make this up you can't make it up <laughs> calm down now calm down calm down it's okay it's just a fish you know it's just we're just fishing we're, we're just oh my God. That a dude. that's a five pounder <laughs> yo guys you cannot make this up <laughs> you can't you can't make it up look at how fat his belly is Yo, there's brutes in this pond, man. I swear. I told you guys I had a tingling slinslation. I would weigh it, but the golf cart's all the way over there. Fletcher's not here yet. He's going to be so mad, honestly. I told him. He had to take a schmedley. I was like, dude, I just got to go fish, man. <laughs> what in the world? That's a five-pounder, though, guys. Like I said, I would go get the scale. I just don't want to keep this girl out of the water too long. I don't want to hurt her. I'm trying to see if Fletcher's pulling up like at the best time ever. But I don't see him. But that is a five pounder. <laughs> Holy cow. I mean, look at that brute. That is a toad, boys. Toad. All right, just show you the size. Look at this. I can't tell. Are these? I think these are 10 and a half. Look at that fish, bro. <laughs> oh. It's a little gushy. I don't know what to say about that, but I think we can confirm that that's a five younder pounder. That is a five younder pounder. They got like small mouths and just they're thick as can be. Thank you, baby. Oh. <laughs> Guys, this is crazy, man. We just started, we caught a three pounder, we caught like a pounder, and then we caught a five, are you kidding me? You can't make that up either. You can't make that up. I, I was like, I got a tingling sensation in my body. Thump. Okay. <laughs> what in the world, guys? There's brutes in this pond. This is the second time we fished here. There's brutes. And I'm not going to lie, the golf course out here isn't the best. Like, the fishing out here, like, I've been to better golf courses. This is just fun. I'm having a good time. Every one of my videos is about having a good I don't care if I'm fishing the river or if I'm fishing a lake. If I'm fishing a pond, if I'm fishing a golf course pond, a farm pond. Listen, man, I'm having fun. That's what it's about. 
a lot of them guys get too competitive at, at it. And listen, man, I, I know about the competitive side. I fished tournaments my whole life. I fished tournaments the last 10 years. But man, I can tell you, I don't care who you are, to catch a fish like that, that's fun. And it just seems like they're biting today. I don't know. Because like I said, we haven't caught a ton out of here. I think we caught three, maybe? Like last time we caught three. I caught this two on the same, pretty much the same cast last time. And then that really big one. I don't know if Fletcher caught any in here. It's just crazy, man. It's just unbelievable. There used to be a ton of grass in this corner and it's all gone. It looks like they either sprayed something or it just died off. I don't really know. But um, holy cow, we caught a freaking five pounder. I didn't even take a picture. Fletcher's not going to believe me. I didn't even take a dang picture. Why didn't I take a picture of that fish? I am by myself. I, I don't know. I have a big problem with taking pictures with fish unless they're like eight plus. I feel that cast for some reason. Something's telling me. Oh my God. He hammered me. Right. You can't make this up guys. Oh my gosh, you can't make this up. So this is my theory, guys. This, this is my game plan right now. I'm covering the bank right now between 5 and 15 foot off. And I'm going to try to catch the fish that are roaming shallow right now this morning. And then I'm actually going to... Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's another... It's another... God, there's no way. Oh my God. This is crazy. <laughs> About a pounder, pound and a half. Pretty little guy. <laughs> Anyways, what I was saying, we got very cloudy conditions, overcast today. It's pretty cool this morning and I'm fishing five to 15 foot off the bank right now, just covering the water, trying to get those bass out of rope. I don't even know what to say. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. Can I start, can I talk? Can I talk to the camera fish? Can I, can I at least just give the people an explanation? Throwing five to 15 foot off the bank. And I'm just covering this water. We got clouds today. These bass should be roaming. And that's exactly what I'm doing. I'm covering the bank because they're running in packs like that. You guys just witnessed it. There's multiple fish roaming along the bank, eating bait fish this morning. When it's in cloudy conditions, that's what you want to do. You know, these fish are going to be roaming so much, you need to be covering some water like this. So I'm just walking down, casting, very basic, and catching these bass that are roaming. Once I'm done fishing the bank on this pond, I'm actually going to start casting out in the middle. And I'm going to cover some of the water out there. But like I said, at first, I'm just fishing the bank right now. There's another good reason on why I'm throwing at the bank right now is because I'd rather catch the fish right here than catch a fish out there and spook the fish on the bank. So I'm trying to catch the fish that are closer to the bank right now. Because at the end of the day, I can catch more if I do it that way than if I go ahead and start throwing out deep right now and I spook all the fish that are up shallow right next to me. This is a little tiny trailer I'm throwing very small. Like recently I've been downsizing my trailer and it seemed to work. Like, I don't know what it is, but downsizing this chatterbait trailer recently has been the key to my success for the last couple of videos. I don't know why, but you know, it, it's working. I put bigger trailers on there. It just hasn't been doing as good. I switch up to a smaller trailer and they're biting it and I'm, I'm still catching good ones on it. Like it's, it's just crazy. So that's something to think about. But let's keep on covering some water and uh, see if we can catch some more. It's been a fantastic day so far. I can't, I can't complain one solid bit. I've already caught five fish, three pounder and a five pounder. I mean, how can you, <laughs> oh my God, eat it. So last time I kind of called my shot on this. There's this tiny indention on the bank. And I was like, you know what? There should be a fish there. And sure enough, it was massive. Maybe there'd be another one sitting here. I think that bite I just had was a good one though. Oh my God. 
Oh my gosh, it's crazy. It's not big, even though he's acting very large. <laughs> that was awesome, man. There's a bunch of these solid, like, pound and a half fish in here. I can tell. A ton of them. The last time the other two that I caught were about this size. And then you just got those footballs, massive fish. Pretty bass, man. These colors on the bass are awesome. Mouse are very small. Just aggressive, hyper little bass. And they're so fun to catch, man. I'm having a good time right now. Thank you, bud. I don't know if I've filmed a video this fast in a very long time. Ooh, that was a fish. Yep, look. I got one more trailer in my pocket. Took my tail. Yo. You good, bro? Yeah, I'm almost there. I'm about to pull up in like two seconds. All right, just wanted to make sure I didn't have to help you come pull it out or something. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna lie, man. I, uh, <laughs> I've, I've caught six fish already, man. Already? Oh my god, there's a huge one next to me. Oh, uh, yeah, I'll see you in a second. All right, bye. Guys, huge bass just tried to eat a dragonfly. Oh my god. Oh, he just had me right there. Oh no. No, 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 not today. This is insane. Oh. That was the hardest hit I've ever had. Oh my gosh. What are these fish on? They were like cracked out or something. That bite right there was insane. What in the world? Oh, dude, it's insane. You forgot your camera? There's some eating dragonflies right here. There was some eating some dragonflies right here. I caught a five and a, oh, nice. and a three. It's crazy. What's up? Is that, is that last Not that fat, no, but he was big, bro. He was, yeah, he was just a big fish. Really? Dude, they're just like, these conditions, like the overcast, they're just, they're it's roaming. Prime. It looks so good. Right oh, it's now, prime, dude. dude. I feel like there's gotta be a giant one in here. There's gotta be. Yeah, you can see everything in this water, dude. He might eat it, he turned away, I think he saw me. It was a good little fish, he got like two pounds. Oh, there it is. there's one. There we go. Just had one, follow it in, threw back in there. Had a good little pounder. Nice. There we go. We actually came back to the pond where I started off. Got us a little old nice bass. I want about two pounds. Try to eat it before this one, but heck, threw back in there and got the job done. Just gonna. Ugh. Jimmy. Ugh. Dang it, Jimmy. These fish are just roaming. Oh, that's depressing. Dude, yeah. what? Oh, there's another one with it. Look, he's trying to get it. He's trying to get it out of his mouth. There's like five. Dude, this is crazy. Oh, oh, what? Oh my God. No way on the dude. That was the craziest. Dude, that was so cool. That was epic. Oh my gosh. You can't make that one up. There was literally five bass. What was I saying? They're roaming like that. Look at Check that. that out. Fletcher yeah, just got bump. out here. Fish bump. Boom. Bow. Look at that. He's throwing a swim bait too. I'll have him show it to the camera. So I was reeling this fish in and there was just like maybe four with there him. Was there was a the ton. Whole, it was a whole lot. pack. And this is the this is a prime example of what I was talking about. These bass are roaming the banks in packs. 
And that's exactly what that was. That was crazy. That was like the most folly thing I've seen yet. Yeah. That is the definition of some fall that fishing at its finest. Man, good thing you were with me. Dude. I know. <laughs> Holy cow. I would have been freaking out. I couldn't have caught him. <laughs> Look at that thing. Like it's it's no giant bait. We filmed the video. We both filmed the video with this guy multiple. But I mean, as you can see, I mean, it's probably about. It's I mean, still a, still a good inches. little good little swim bait. I mean, heck. Yeah. 